Hi, my name is Fozia Kadir. I'm a doctoral candidate at New York University and a friend of Big Picture Learning. Today I'm going to be reading you a story called Bedtime Bonnet by Nikki Red and illustrated by Nika Myers. Bedtime Bonnet. In my family, when the sun goes down, our hair goes up. My brother twists and tightens each of his locks. Sis combs her hair in a swirl around her head. Daddy's hairbrush makes rolls of black waves appear. Grandma rolls up her silver mane. Grandpa doesn't do anything to his hair because he doesn't have any. After mommy gathers her corkscrew curls in a scarf, she calls for me. I scoop between her legs and she gets to work on my hair. I'm tender-headed, so she's extra gentle. Grandpa tells jokes as mommy works her magic. He asks me, why does the bee have sticky hair? I don't know. So he says, because it uses a honeycomb. Silly grandpa. Finally, a braided crown is on top of my head and it's time for bed. Except, I can't find my bedtime bonnet. I needed to protect my hair from tangles and lint while I sleep. Wearing my bonnet at night is important as brushing my teeth. Maybe grandma knows where it is. She's covering her rollers with a kerchief. Grandma, have you seen my bonnet? She gets up and looks around. No, dear, I haven't. Maybe your sister knows. My sister's still in the bathroom. Her hair is spun in a wrap. Sis, have you seen my bonnet? She looks in all the bathroom drawers. No, but here's daddy's wave cap. I take the cap to daddy and he pops it onto his waves. Daddy, have you seen my bonnet? He looks around the sofa, but it's not there either. Where in the world could my bonnet be? I can't go to bed without it. Just then my big brother walks in, a do-rag slipped over his locks. Does he know where it is? Big bro, have you seen my bonnet? He doesn't even pretend to look. He just says, ask grandpa. Oh, grandpa. My bonnet is now in its proper place and I'm really sleepy. Everyone gives me kisses and hugs and mommy and daddy read me a story. Good night, family. In the morning, when the sun comes up, our hair comes down. Daddy smooths his ocean-like waves. Mommy scrunches her ribbony curls. Sis unwinds her foot-long wrap. My brother shakes out his lovely locks. While Grandma unsnaps her rollers, Grandpa shaves his head. And as for me, my bonnet comes off and my braids come out. Now we're all ready for a brand new day. The end. Wasn't that cute? Reminds me of when I was a little girl when my mom used to do my hair. Hope you enjoyed the story.